We see different outro screens in different sorts of videos. In our previous tutorial, we talked about how to make a YouTube outro for a vlog video. Today, we're going to learn how to create a cinematic movie style outro. If you are interested in this, keep watching. Firstly, let's have a look at the composition of a cinematic movie style outro. It often consists of a few videos and a lot of texts. For example, it has a black background. The whole picture can be divided into two parts. On the left, there is a collection of outtakes, bloopers, and anything other motion graphics information we want our audiences to see. On the right, there are scrolling credits for showing thanks to the people involved in a video project. In today's video, we put more focus on how to create these scrolling texts. Now it's time to bring our ideas to reality. Launch up the software, start a new project, add the video and the music files we prepare to the software, drag the video to video track, Find a shoe or high layout rectangle under the preview window. Select it, so we can adjust the size and the position of the video. Then we drag the music to audio track. Come over to the inspector panel on the top right and add a fade out effect. Now we want to add a text. Find the Titles icon, click on it, scroll down to find a preset, drag that preset to Subtitle Track, and align up the preset with the video. Then we go to the Inspector panel for making some basic edits. Input the text content. Select a good somatic font. Adjust the size for the text. Then we drag the slider to reposition the text. That's all about making basic edits for the text. After that, we go to the Edit Text button on the top. Click on it for adding some advanced edits. For example, we want to add a scrolling text. Thus, we hit Animation and choose Up Out effect. We'll notice the list of the credits scrolls up the screen quickly. That's not what we want, but no worry. Let's scroll down our mouse to find the animation time on the right. Move the slider to increase the duration of the animation clip. Preview the clip now. The list of the credits now scrolls up slowly. Hit Apply to apply the changes. Let's preview the video to check the result. We are almost there, but the video on the left ends too abrupt. It doesn't match with some music that has a fade out effect. Come over to the transition icon Click on it. During, we have many transition presets to choose from. Drag the fade to black transition preset to the end of the video on the video track. After that, we drag our mouse to adjust the duration for this transition effect. Now have a look at the outcome. Alright, hopefully this tutorial about creating a cinematic movie outro can help you. Don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe if you haven't yet. We'll see you in our next tips. Hope and enjoy! Bye!